What's up guys, it's your boy Ty Skits here today and we're playing Car X Drift Racing Online. And in today's Car X Drift Racing Online video, I'll be showing you guys the best, I mean like literally the best ultimate drift setup for the Shark GT, aka the BMW M5. So what you want to go ahead and do is go to Class 5 and find the Shark GT, purchase it, get the ultimate drift setup on the car, and a body kit if you have enough money. I'm broke right now as you can see, I only have 657k, and the body kits for this are about, oh, well, let's just not talk about that. So you want to go ahead and head to your dyno stand, your front spring length is going to be 8, your rear spring length is going to be 6, your front spring stiffness is going to be 225, your rear spring stiffness is going to be 235, your front shock stiffness is going to be 80, I couldn't get mine on because the freaking devs won't fix the tuning menu and it's laggy, but uh, yeah, your rear shock stiffness is going to be 80%, your front toe is going to be 0 0.41, your rear toe is going to be negative 0 0.21, your front camera is going to be negative 5.91, your rear camera is going to be negative 2.65, uh, for your front and rear anti roll bar is going to be 50, your, cast your caster is going to be 9.0, your Ackerman angle is going to be at 54%, and your max steering angle is going to be at 60 degrees. For your wheels, your front and rear rim diameter are going to be 20, your front tire width is going to be 325, your rear tire width is going to be 285, your front and rear tire pressure are going to be at 190, your front and rear wheel adhesion are going to be at 120, your front wheel track is going to be at 0, and your rear base is going to be at negative 3. It's going to be a little bit wider if you have a body kit, I don't have a body kit yet like I said, I'm broke. Wait, yeah, I do have a body kit, but it's actually no, I don't. Wait, do I? I don't know. I don't know if this spoiler came stock or not. I might. Wait. Okay, let me just continue with the video. So your front and rear tire profile are going to be at 20%. You turn all your engine tune ups all the way to max. Your transmission diff locking ratio is going to be 1.00. Your final drive is going to be 4.00. Your gear 1 is going to be 3.82. Your gear 2 is going to be 2.35. Your gear 3 is going to be 1.47. Your gear 4 is going to be 1.21. Your gear 5 is going to be 1.11. And your gear 6 is going to be at 1.03. For your brakes, your brake torque is going to be 7K. Your front brake bias is going to be 70%. ABS, no. Launch control, no. Let's go. So, if you guys find this tune helpful, make sure to drop a like on this video and at least share this video with one of your car extra racing online friends that also play the game, whether it's a friend you know in real life or a name you just, uh, or a, a player or a friend that you just know over PSN, share this tune with them. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel, like I said, make sure to drop a like on this video, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. This is the Ty Skids Shark GT. Let's get it. So the gears you're going to be want to be in is going to be third and fourth. Now look at how smooth third is. Like, oh my God, this is, bruh, bruh. This thing is amazing. Hit him with the fourth gear. Hit him with the reverse entry. Don't go too far though. Ooh, six thousand. Let's get it. Hit him with that 360. Come on, now. let's go. We all about it, man. We all about it, man. This has been Ty Skits playing Cars Drift Racing Online, and today I showed you guys the best ultimate drift setup for the Shark GT, aka the BMW M5, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.